most drivers fail to communicate effectively. In other words, they suck at signaling and telling other traffic what they're doing. It's like the cartoon of the husband and wife laying in bed at night and she thinks that he doesn't love her anymore and might be having an affair. And then the switches to him and he has the mind thought that uh, he's trying to figure out what's wrong with his motorcycle. He's been in the shop all day working on his motorcycle and can't figure out what's wrong with it. Miscommunication, <laughs> assumptions. That's what happens when most people are driving. They do not communicate effectively and they wonder why other people don't allow them to change lanes and they speed up beside them because they didn't put their signal on and ask or they're parallel parking and they didn't put the vehicle into reverse and put their activate their turn signal to tell other people that that in fact is what they're doing. Better relationships when you're driving result from communication. Today we're going to parallel park for real and show you how to do this after you get your license. Okay, first thing we do is locate the parallel parking spot and there's one right here. Mirror signal shoulder check, signal to the right. Line up the back ends, I put it in reverse, the truck behind me waited. 45, straighten out the wheels. And we're into the space. Back up, straighten out our wheels, and just like that. And the truck waited for us. I think the truck even backed up, which is not something you should do uh, if you're waiting for somebody to parallel park. But signal on, reverse lights on, indicates that the vehicle is going to parallel park. And in bigger cities, people are going to be parallel parking all the time. So know that and to leave the space into reverse, 360 degree check, make sure there's nobody around and we back up just two or three feet. Mirror signal shoulder check, that truck is sticking out behind us. You can see it is quite a ways out. So I gotta actually stick my nose out here so I can see in the mirror. Shoulder check, nobody coming and we proceed. This video is made possible by the course package pass your driver's test first time because we know that your driver's test is the most stressful day of your life and without some form of driver training your chances of passing are less than 50 percent as a bonus we'll include both the defensive and winter driving smart courses these will make you a safer smarter driver and reduce your chances of being involved in an accident click down in the description there and get full details so again we've located our spot in behind that white car up there got traffic behind me Mirror signal shoulder check. And I pull up so the back ends at approximately three feet. Vehicle behind me waits because I have my reverse lights on. Okay, 45, straighten the wheels. Nice and slow, or don't get pushed by other cars. Okay, and into the spot. And we touch the curb, and that's okay. Adjust, and back into the space. You're not on a driver's test now. This is parallel parking for real. So you got the feel for the car. We just pull up so we can see the top of the bumper. And just like you did when you're preparing for your driver's test, into park, parking brake on, whether it's electric or whatnot, and then stop, secure the vehicle, lock it when you leave, and then go and do your shopping and come back to the vehicle. If you're preparing to leave, hold the foot brake, put the transmission into reverse, parking brake off, out through the back window, 360 degree check, and we back up just a little bit so we can get past the car in front. Mirror signal shoulder check, there's a car coming around the corner. Car is going very slow. And another car, so you always wanna shoulder check again, check your mirrors, there's a car is coming around the corner, I'm right at the intersection here. So there's somebody that wants to go in behind me there gonna stop yes that vehicle is trying to figure out what they're doing and they finally saw my signal I was communicating effectively now I saw this person signal this person in front of me communicated effectively and now they're going to parallel park I'm just gonna stay here and wait for them reverse lights parallel parking 
and they're in the space and we can proceed. So the next time you say to yourself when you're merging that nobody's gonna let you in or that people will not wait for you to parallel park, try signaling because signals are to tell others that you wish to move over, not that you are moving over. For more information, smartdrivetest.com. And remember, pick the best answer, not necessarily the right answer. Have a great day. Bye now. Hang on there one sec. The thought of failing your driver's test <laughs> is what keeps you up at night right now. Click the link over here. Check out the Smarter Driver course package that guarantees that you will pass your driver's test first time. Click the link and check that out. And have a great day. All the best. Bye now.